we are, we are a digital marketing institute uh, monica takes you talk about content who do we give reference to and who do we follow joe kuletsi from content marketing institute right and we social media examiner exactly yeah. but we so joe kuletsi if he says that blogs are working do we question that because he's researched it he's you know he's doing enough a uh, background work for him to actually come out and make a statement now joe kuletsi is an influencer in the industry of content true right right now there are no disputes there right and we do not even question that in fact he is one of our strongest he and his company are one of the strongest resources we give out in our classes right at wma why don't we question that why don't we say that why not blogs why not start something else as in blogs are like passing you know i mean who cares about blogs anymore and we should just like let go of it can we even make such horrendous statements like, it's not possible right so he's my point being that he has taken the responsibility to the extent of actually making a conversion he's converted all of us to believe and to ensure and actually in in practical life see that you know blogs are working Yeah, and blog in the sense content. Content are yes. work. One format of content blogs right. are working, right? Right. So, but if we did not see that, and if blogs were not working for us, this is just as an example, right? If blogs were not working across for everybody uh, in the industry, and if they were doing it right, and it was still not working for them, then would Joe Pulitzi still be an influencer for content because he make makes those statements, right? Or he says that okay, fine, B two B marketing. Uh, Uh, in in B two B sectors, uh, social media is on a rise. Now, do we question that? Because there is an entire research he publishes. His company does an entire research and they publish it, right? So, do we still question that? But he converts us, right? We, I work in the B two B sector. There are so many times when we go back to his research to see who are the other companies. You know, what sort of things have they done? Uh, why? But then done? he substantiates what he is. same yeah right. but he is because he is an influencer exactly so because of the influencer mentality he is actually making that conversion to all of us he is converting all of us people are not just following right? yeah, and people are not he's just following he is a practitioner and he is we are not following just what he says we are also looking at the research right. so it's also a, a decision made by the head yeah it's but not a complete hard decision that okay joe kulitzi is an influencer he says it works so i'm just going to do it yeah but then that will only be till some time right you how long will how long uh, will it take for you to actually take his word No, I think over a period of time you yeah, exactly. do it, and then you see okay, he keeps publishing these research. There should be something. Exactly, trust, so building the trust. Building the trust. Absolutely, what my that's exactly where I was getting both of you to. That he's built so much of trust that if you if you follow him and if you read what his company does, you will see that after three, four, five, six times of you know wanting to actually okay, I need like some sort of uh, research behind what he's saying and all of that. Once you do all of that. Seven, eight, nine times. Anything he says, you just take it on face value because he's been able to build that trust and he's able to convert you into a follower. You know, through whatever, through act, actually practicing what he is saying, or through, backed up with research. Yeah, yes. you know, in whichever manner, right? So my point being that an influencer's duty today, uh, be it be it a celebrity. or you know be it a non celebrity uh, in in a, in non film world celebrity or just a normal person yeah they should really uh, build the trust factor